beach. I checked the weather, I checked the map, and it wasn't supposed to start raining until noon today for an hour and then sunny the rest of the day. But it's 9-12 and it's thunderstorms. Thunder, lightning, heavy rain, the works. I'm already, I'm almost 20, I'm almost to the beach. I'm about 25 minutes out. I'm still gonna go and figure things out. I don't think anybody's at this beach, guys. Like this was my plans and it's raining and no one's here. But I still just want to take a look at the beach when it's raining. I want to see what it looks like. No one is here. I'm the only one. They say it's $10, but I mean, no one's here. So we're just going to park, take up a couple spots and chill for a minute. My plans were ruined. It's raining and no one's at the beach. Like no one. And you... I read the reviews, you have to pay $10 to get into the beach, but the place that you pay, it's closed. No one's in there. You just drive right through. The gate was open. Everything was open. Don't come for me. I have been wearing this shirt a lot, but this is my only beach shirt, and I did wash this yesterday, so everything I'm wearing is clean, so don't come for me. You will see this um, shirt in many videos while I still can wear it. Oh, I see somebody else pulling. I guess they pulled out. Let's go take a look. Um, can't go to the beach. I'm literally the only one. Look at that. Look how powerful that beach is. Wow. I do have an umbrella. I might actually go down there. It might be a little dangerous, but we'll see. There's nothing more alluring, attractive, sexy than the beach on a rainy, thunderstorm, windy day. Look how sexy those waves are. It's gonna be muddy and nasty, but we're going. Wow. take my shoes off. Wow. And for those of you who asked me in my videos, this is not an ocean. This is Lake Michigan. This is one of the lakes in Michigan. Our lakes look like oceans. But they're not. We're literally the only people out here. Oh wow, there's lightning, let's go. When I saw that lightning, I was out of there. I ain't stupid now. Ooh, I ran up that dirt hill so fast. I saw that lightning. We gonna chill here for a bit. The rain is supposed to let up in about, I don't know, 30 minutes or so, we'll see. Oh, I cleaned my feet off. Now. I gotta clean my dirty shoes. Woo. Thank you. 
stopped raining and look how powerful that lake is after it rains. I'm still the only one here. I'm the only one on this beach. Nobody, nobody. I'm the only one. I guess people are afraid that they're gonna melt. It is pretty scary down here being on the beach after it rains because the tide, it's crazy. Nobody and the water is so powerful. This is one of the most beautiful things I've ever witnessed is Lake Michigan after a thunderstorm. I wish I could stay all day, but I got some business to take care of. The RV, I gotta go uh, to General RV. My ceiling fan in the living room started leaking. So I'm thinking maybe it needs to be resealed from the top. I'm not sure, but they can get me in today. I'm grateful, so we're gonna go get that taken care of. I would stay here all day. Man, this is so beautiful. Michigan is a hidden gem. Definitely so many beaches here in Michigan, so much to see. But I didn't come to Michigan to be a tourist. I came to get things done, to reset and uh, recharge for um, another adventure. Michigan is my home base for now. Man, isn't that beautiful? That's powerful. See it leaking? See that leaking? Watch. See the water? See the water coming out? Look at all that water. You see? It's leaking only right there. Nothing right there. Nothing right there. Nothing right there. It's just leaking all across here, which makes no sense. Makes no sense, but we're gonna go get that fixed, hopefully today. And for those of you in my comments, that's gonna say, go get a new van. Oh my God, this is a lemon. Please spare me. Um, because if you've ever owned an RV, you know this is normal. I've had this RV for over a year. I've been on the rockiest, bumpiest road you could think of. I've been in the, the, the tsunamis downpour of Florida. Uh, so it's been through a lot. So the little stuff that's happening now is meant to be. I, I'm not stressing over that. They can get me in, they can take care of it. I was gonna seal it myself, but I think there might be a bigger issue. They might need to seal it from the top on the roof, which I can't get up. So they fixed my um, ceiling fan. My caseworker at General RV, she showed me that when the mechanic went up top on top of my van, that the sealant that goes around it was cracked just from wear and tear and it needed to be resealed. It was an easy fix. It was just wear and tear, which I figured. Um, let me tell you something, General RV Michigan, is the place to get stuff done. Now, if you ain't from Michigan, don't be coming up here, uh, flooding up the channels, cause look, how am I gonna get my work done? Nah, yeah, Michigan is is it. They, they get you in, they're quick, they're efficient, they're patient, they're nice, they're sweet. So yeah, that this is where I come to get all my work done. Uh, I attempted to go in Florida. Unfortunately, Florida's just too overwhelmed with the tourists and a lot of snowbirds and stuff, but Michigan's where it's at. <sighs> Thank you.
So I don't have a keychain, and when I went to Meyer, I was like trying to figure out what I could put my key on so that I could hang it up. And uh, I bought this little animal keychain, and uh, it's a little paw pink. And I think it'll just be good to have a keychain on it. That way, um, I can hang this keychain up. I can hang my key up where it's like right within hands or arms reach instead of just having it like that and putting it on a counter or something. So my plan is this, I'm gonna show you, but there we go. I was trying to be more minimalistic by just having this, but I think it's just a safer bet to have a keychain. You know, it'll enable me to hang this up. So tomorrow I'm gonna hang this up, probably like right here. So it'll always be right where I know where it is. Just some spray butter. cinnamon raisin bread okay this is dinner toast butter and jam eggs with uh, ketchup on it first bite of this beautiful toast goes to whoever wants to try it I know it's a bit sloppy uh, it's not my best work for dinner but and this is just eggs with ketchup no salt no pepper no nothing have that bite right there for whoever wants it now my turn Mm. it's very rare that I put ketchup on my eggs I had this in my cabinet I don't know why I bought a big bottle don't even ask me it's gonna take me a whole year to use that probably even two years if it's if it's good if it's good that long nope 2024 so I got a year Next time, I'll just eat the toast with the butter because it takes away from that cinnamon raisin taste. It's still good, but it would have been better without the jam. Tomorrow, I have a very, a very important appointment to attend. And I cannot miss this appointment. Oh, don't worry, I'm taking you guys with. Tomorrow is gonna to be a very, very, very important appointment and I don't wanna miss it. It's in the morning, so I do need to get some rest. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish my dinner, uh, get some rest, and I will see you guys bright and early in the morning for my very important appointment and I will be telling you guys all about that appointment tomorrow. So right now I'm on my way to go take a shower. I have a <clears throat> appointment that I have to, to be at at 1030. It's almost eight o'clock. So after my shower, we're gonna head out to the appointment. It's about an hour drive. And once I get there, I'll let you know what the appointment is about and why I'm doing it. But first, let me get a shower and then get back on the road and we'll go from there. We're here, Planet Fitness. Oh, I'm gonna go park, get this quick shower. So I finally made it to this audio place that's going to be um, installing my alarm system. Um, after the events that took place uh, over Labor Day weekend, I feel that uh, installing an alarm system would be a great investment 
not only for my security but for my safety um, I feel like if the guy that was shaking my driver's side door handle the way that he was shaking it hard trying to open the door the the alarm system would have went off or I could have hit the panic button um, so I'm very pleased with the investment I did shop around and it's called impact audio and accessories was the the place that I found that had the best uh, prices highest ratings um, for uh, installation of car alarms I did call and talk to the guy I told him what kind of van I had everything he seemed really knowledgeable on what he had to do and so here in the next 30 minutes I will be getting um, an alarm installed into my van so I'm really happy about that So I'm done. Uh, it took about a couple hours. I got a basic alarm system and uh, I think I thought all cars came standard with alarms but being a 2021 ProMaster uh, they did not and I didn't have an alarm. So now that I have an alarm system I feel a lot more safe, a lot more comfortable. So when I lock it you can hear it activate and uh, yeah if anybody tries to break in it'll go off and uh, if I feel threatened and I'm inside I'll set it off. So I'm super, super stoked about that. And that's all I ever wanted, just peace of mind. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this coffee and I will see you guys in shortly. So I went to Bigsby Coffee and got a medium ice black coffee. And it's actually pretty good. This is only the second time I've ever been to Bigsby Coffee. Um, in my life and I think I'm gonna start going here as opposed to Starbucks no I know I am Starbucks is too expensive this coffee a medium ice black coffee two dollars and seventeen cents can't beat that but I want to thank each and every one of you for your well wishes um, prayers positive vibes um, it means a lot to me I am human I made a mistake and I learned from that mistake <laughs> really quick um, I feel a lot better knowing that I have an alarm system that's just a lot more peace of mind. I can't believe that I've been traveling on the road for almost a year and a half with no alarm system. But um, now that I have one, I can tell you I definitely feel a lot safer, a lot better. And you would think that being a 2021 Ram ProMaster that it would come standard with an alarm system, but it didn't. But that's neither here nor there. Now I have one and I can tell you I'll sleep a lot better. Um, at night knowing that I have just that extra layer of security added to my van but I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me that was pretty cool seeing that beach um, going to the ocean when it rains or not the ocean girl get it together uh, going to a beach when it rains um, those waves were powerful um, just seeing how the tide uh, how the weather affects the tide and it's incredible it was so beautiful um my um before i get out of here let me show you my um it rained today and my ceiling vent was fixed there's no water coming out of it nothing everything's cleaned up i checked it again that's just wear and tear on the vent uh they said that when they went up there it was cracked but the guy did take care of it i shouldn't have any more problems um out of it but i do need a ladder because I could have got it myself. I did see pictures of what it looked like. Um, I did see pictures of what it looked like up top and it was just cracked due to just like wear and tear from like rain, sun, all of that stuff. But yeah, the van is good. Uh, no more problems. Everything is set to go. Everything is cleared. <sighs> what a relief. Just to come to Michigan and be able to get everything done that I needed without waiting weeks, months. Michigan's where it's at to get things done for your RV. That 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 is for sure. But I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. I do appreciate you guys hanging out with me over the last couple days. Um, it means the world to me. You guys are freaking amazing. I have the best community on YouTube. I'll continue to say it until I can't say it anymore. You guys rock. Uh, so thank you so much for just being an awesome community. 
Uh, dinner wasn't the best. Scrambled eggs and and toast. Uh, I just it was just it was just a long day yesterday, and I just wanted something quick to make. But I'll make it up to you guys uh, the next time I cook. Uh, rest assured, I'll definitely make that up to you guys. But I'm out. Thanks for watching, and as always, I will see you guys in my next video. Take care. Peace.